All right, my friend. Welcome. This is your first time with us here, right? Mm -hmm. You said you were recommended here by a nurse? Yeah, well, uh, we're my uh, primary doctor. Mm -hmm. she, she do the referral. Gotcha. So how long have you had this problem? Years? Okay. Has anybody dealt with this for you before? Any doctor? Anyone? No. No? Okay. Well, I appreciate you coming today, man. I want to get you all taken care of. So you, you tried to take care of these yourself at home? Yeah. Do you have any pain in any of them? Mm -hmm. Yeah? Yeah. Which one hurts the most? Yeah. The big toe? Yeah. yeah, it seems like it. How are you able to wear shoes comfortably? I can, uh, I can. That's because of my nails being like that. That's because when I wear, I would give the shoes an extra size. Okay. Relax your foot for me. There we go. Big piece. And I would, you know, normally I used to be wearing them, uh, uh, them metal wire shoes. Uh huh. Then, but now I just, you know, the wire ones. Okay. What about socks? Are you able to keep your socks in yeah. your condition? Uh, they, they don't they don't cut holes in your socks? Yeah. Okay. And see, if I don't feel like this, because I normally have to always wear white socks. Mm-hmm. Pretty much that's going to get half bad foot. Right. All right. So, when was the last time you tried to trim them yourself? Relax your foot? I can't because I can't, you know, really, uh, do nothing because it's probably trying, you know, uh, keep it clean, you know. Uh -huh. I can't, you know, I'm going to have to have something like a aid come in and do it. Okay. Are you able to reach your feet okay? Not really, uh-huh. Okay. Yeah, because I see this a lot when people who have issues like arthritis and whatnot. Mm -hmm. They can't really reach their feet easily or, or comfortably. So these things can happen. I'm glad you just decided to come on in, man. Get this squared away. So what I'm doing, I'm collecting some samples of your nails and send to the lab. All right. You know, it's definitely a, a fungal infection. I just need right. to, I just need to know which organisms are causing it, so we know the right medication to choose. That's why I'm collecting samples here. Looks like you got some issues. On the, between your toes and the bottom of your feet as well. I'm going to get all that squared away. How's this callus feel over here on the side? Machine the rest of that down. Relax it for me. There you go. Let me know if it's too uncomfortable for you. I want to make sure we get it down real nice for you. Because this hasn't been done for you in quite some time. Excuse me. 
Yeah, we're just getting started, my man. Clean this out. Well, you think, well, my phone there grow back? Oh, they're going to grow back, but the, the trick is to get the right medication so, right, that, so, right. That, they, so that they grow back normally. Mm -hmm. That's going to take some time. Right. This is going to take, you know, at least six months or more. I'm just being honest with you. But, you know, we get you on the right medication based on what we see from the lab. I'm going to see you here every two months to get things, uh, right. keep them straight, uh, keep them in shape, and get you back on track, man. So when next time I'll be here from the Yeah, yeah, you'll hear from us within about two weeks. That way we'll know which medication to use. Clean out between the toes now. A little toe floss in here. Clean out the inside here between the toes. There we go, another one. What I'd like to say. Basically. <laughs> basically. Got to keep it clean in here. Right. Go. Got a little bit what the old folks used to call toe jam in here. Yeah, we're getting that out, boy. Do the flip side now. now any pain on this uh, on the right foot? No. Good. Yeah, keep your foot down here for me. Still good? Yeah, I love your attitude, man. Because, you know, we have a lot of people who have to deal with these things, relax your phone, who have to deal with these things, and they're just, you know, too embarrassed to come in and get it taken care of. But as you, you know already, it's not going to fix itself, right? Right. Because, you know, I... I I usually, you know, when I go to the doctor, uh -huh. and, you know, they tell me to take out my socks and all that, and I tell you, you know, I'm starting to take, you know, my bad feet. Okay. Shame. Gotcha. And stuff like that. So what made you finally get over it this time? Man, I, you know, I got tired. I, you know, just, you know, just long as, you know, let it out. For sure. You know, you know, you know, sign stuff. How's this big toenail feel? It's good. All right. I 
have any champion. <laughs> So when was the last time you saw your medical doctor? The one who sent you here? Uh, last week. Okay. Where I you know, went for my, uh, my blood test and all that. Mm hmm How things turn out? Yeah. Oh, everything, you know, everything is good. Excellent. It's that, you know, when you know, you know, diabetes, you know, diabetes. Mm hmm But I'm like, you know, like, you know, diabetes, you know, step on the tea. Mm hmm You know, I'm, you know, on the pills and stuff, and mm -hmm. that's on me. Right. You doing a good job keeping your oh, yeah. sugar in control. Yeah, you see, my pretty that's you know, by my feet and all that. Mm -hmm. uh, they tell me, you know, the way people tell me, you know, they told you to cut off and all that. Yes, sir. Well, you work with us on a regular, man. We can yeah, I'm very prevent I'm that stuff from happening, boy. I'm, I'm definitely. Yep. Mm-hmm. Like These big two toenails you had? Mm -hmm. We call those ram's horn nails. Oh yeah. Yeah. Because it look like the, the, the horn on a ram. These gutters cleaned out. Yeah. I appreciate that, sir. Yeah, you're gonna make me earn it today, my friend. Appreciate you. Hey, no problem, man. That's why we're here. Is uh, is you gonna give me type of medicine for today? Not. Are we gonna get a, a cream for the bottom of your feet? Okay, okay. But once we know what's going on with the nails from the lab mm -hmm. in the next couple of weeks, then we'll know how we're gonna take care of the okay, nails. Okay. I don't like to get ahead of the game with the nails. Right, right. Yep. Is the new in here somewhere? Uh, it wasn't with the... Yeah, it's Got it? Okay. Are you the only doctor in No, the, uh, my partner, Dr. Lebesi, here. She's oh, in one of the other rooms. Friday's our pretty busy day here. Now, after you finish bathing and showering, mm -hmm. you're gonna have to make sure that you get dry between the toes like I'm doing here. Okay, okay. So would I get some gauze? Gauze or just an extra uh, washcloth okay. and go between. Yeah, I, I recommend using a separate washcloth and what you dry the rest of your body off with. Right, right. Because that towel's still gonna be a little moist. But I think I'd be, I'd be better off you like the gold, like my, like, you got? That's fine. Except I think because you can walk around here and think about mm -hmm. getting between the bags. Yeah. There's our collection here. Oh, this is going to the lab. Uh huh. This might tickle a little bit. <laughs> or a lot of it. We'll see. This is just water, okay? Pickle? Sorry about that, bro. Necessary evil.
So what was that right there doing? What I'm doing is taking down the thickness, mm -hmm. removing as much as the fungal material from under the nail as possible. Okay. And, the, and the water eliminates the friction mm -hmm. so it doesn't irritate your skin. Right, right. And also eliminates the nail dust okay. so we're not breathing that stuff in. Right, right. Okay. You know, when I came in, mm -hmm. I came up here, I said, 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 I we actually get cases like this pretty often, man. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Doing all right?
This is Kevin Jefferson, the DC Foot Doctor. Thank you for watching this video. Like it with a big thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Share it with your family and friends and ring the bell so you will know when a new video has been uploaded. If you have any of the issues in this video or any of my other videos, see a podiatrist as soon as possible. But most importantly, take care of your feet.